हरे कृष्णा बिटवीन नाइविटी एंड सिनिसिजम इज द करेज टू ट्रस्ट वेन एवर वी फॉर्म अ रिलेशनशिप विथ एनी वन और फॉर दैट मैटर वेन वी फॉर्म अ रिलेशनशिप विथ विद द डिवाइन एट दैट टाइम देर इज अ सर्टन अमाउंट ऑफ ट्रस्ट रिक्वायर्ड एंड सम पीपल थिंक दैट Trust is weakness. Actually, our uh, trust is coward. Is you can't face the problems of life, so you put faith in some unknown power. However, a trust requires courage, and is the opposite of trust that often is a sign of cowardice. Now we could have one extreme where of naivety. Now naivety means that that person doesn't. think at all the person thinks that oh everything is wonderful everyone is wonderful and everybody who goes off in the goes off in the name of spirituality is great and this naivety can make us burn terribly it can happen in our horizontal relationship with others and it can happen in our vertical relationship with god either way when we are naive and we get burnt which will sooner which we will be sooner or later then at that time we need to have courage the cowardly reaction to the betrayal of trust on naivety is to go to the other extreme of cynicism cynicism is the level where we refuse to trust anyone where we become cold hearted and we in order to protect our heart keep it isolated and distance from others but a heart that doesn't trust rusts uh, that that's what happens it just becomes lonely it becomes cold it, and our life becomes uh, uh, ceases to be life it it gets stripped of joy if we don't trust and we need that balance so yes it's possible that uh, we it's possibly even probable that we may have been burned because of trust or because of naively trusting people but by refusing to trust anyone by becoming cynical we stay where we are our heart can't connect with anyone we can't elevate our consciousness so in between is the courage to trust we know that we may go wrong but with the best intelligence we have exercising the caution as much as is reasonable we move forwards and it is through such such cautious trust that such trust is cautious but it's also courageous it's the cowardly reaction would be to refuse to trust anyone and stay inside a shell the courageous come cautious response is to trust and the bhagavad gita says that when we trust in the, this way then we gain knowledge then we gain self mastery and then ultimately we gain spiritual realization realization of the div- divine and the supreme joy thereof the bhagavad gita 4.39 states shraddha vallabhate gyanam tatparah sanyate indriyah gyanam labdha param shantim achirena digachati so shraddha vall it is only when we have the courage to trust then we can gain deeper understanding labhate gyanam we can know god more and more when we follow a process to know him and then just as in every relationship when you put some faith uh, we open our heart to that person and they open their heart to us and we get to know them better so like that same applies to god we know him better tat par hasyate indriya and as we become devoted to him we become attached to him our senses come under control we stop getting caught in pleasures that betray us and gyanam labdha param shantim achirena digachati gyanam labdha when we gain such knowledge then we become peaceful supremely unflappably peaceful that is the fruit of having the courage to trust the courage to trust gives us a peace that is unflappable that is imperishable that is eternal thank you hare krishna